Okay, so this Amazon Publisher Studio tool can be a bit confusing. So this is the toolbar that pops up on your screen after you load the script from when you started um, in that previous screen share that I just showed you. There are a few options. You can get rid of it by clicking those little arrows and then bring it back. There are ways you can move this around. Um, first, sign in and then it'll give you options for settings. So it'll bring you the sign-in screen. Telling you you've been signed in. Then it gives you the tag option, provide feedback. Here were your settings where you can take this um, toolbar and you can move it to the bottom. See how it brought it over here to the bottom? It's, especially if it's in the way of what you're doing. You can hide it. I guess I like mine at the top. Okay, so here I'm just going to go through a post that's already live. And I'm going to find some words that I can tag. Uh, let's see, let's do a minion party. See what's on Amazon for minion party. I have to be in tag mode for it to come up. So I've highlighted the word, it brought up the Amazon screen, and I had already typed in Minion Party, and I saw some cute cups earlier. Let's see, oh, let me just choose these. Okay, so that's been tagged with that link that I just threw in there. I've already added um, a Shop Now button to here. Let me see if I can do another photo to show you. Let's add one here, so just click the image. Oops, I'm not in tag mode. And it took me to the image out of my post since I wasn't in tag mode. Oops. No. Okay, back to my post. I'm going to be back in page mode. See how it grayed out that photo? You can tell when you're about to tag something. Um, it went to that photo because I wasn't in tag mode, and when I clicked on the photo, it brought me to the link of that picture. So just be sure you're in tag mode. I'm not sure about their theater mode yet. I haven't even tried it. Tag mode, but um, I'm going to go down here, and I'm going to put this photo. I'm going to search for bubbles on Amazon. Um, Bubbles for kids, maybe. Okay, there's some. So now it'll bring up bubbles when somebody wants to hover over it, and it doesn't interfere with my pin it button, which is nice. So now if I want to continue on and I'm done putting all my tags, uh, unless I have any other words, let me see, is there, oh, goggles, let's see, a Sharpie, let's do a Sharpie. Why not? There we go, here's a cheap one. Yay, see how it added the link? Okay, so you can just highlight it, it'll search for what it is. It's that simple. And then I'm just gonna click on undo my tag mode and the tags are there. You don't have to save, nothing. You've added the tags and that's it. Then you can sign out or you can move it or whatever. Hope that helps.